Where are you going tonight, Grace? I'm going to my staff party. Ooh. Which I have organized in my sexy voice, my Phoebe voice from Friends. <laughs> you know that episode where she had, she's like, hello, my baby. Yeah, and, and then she's like convinced that she sings like very well, but actually she, she doesn't. So what kind of shoes are you going to wear? Okay, so we have three options. Mm -hmm. The first option is this Balenciaga pair, Ooh. which has like a peep toe. And I was thinking of wearing like a sparkly black Sexy sock. Sexy stiletto heel. The second pair is a Nicholas Kirkwood sample sale for £15 Ooh. in electric blue, which I love, but I can't walk in them because they're very high. The third <laughs> so, pair is... So I think I'm going to exclude them from the... <laughs> yeah. The third pair is when I was really into fast fashion and they're a cheapy brand from ASOS and it's like a red sock booty. Well, but since now you're eco-friendly, you need to wear them as much as you can. I know. So that actually you put them into good but use. But the trouble with these is that I feel like the drama is lost. If you wear like a skinny trouser, you need to wear like... A skirt. And I don't wear skirts. So, what about dress? I don't wear I don't a have dresses. <laughs> I have trousers and jeans. Wash your face now. Rip me up the proper Yeah. Do all that you can. Oh, the rain is glorious. We, we're just walking to Dalesford to get some veggies, some sourdough maybe. And the plan for today, after we had a huge brunch, is to make an apple crumble and chicken soup, not in that order, and watch some TV. Pretty much do nothing because we're both quite tired. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Look at the lovely festive flowers. So we just got back from a little outing and look at these beautiful Christmas blooms, the red berries, and I got some more greenery over there. Tree is looking beaut. And we bought some very naughty stollen pipes <laughs> from, uh, from Dalesford. So we're just having a cup of tea and a little stollen. Uh, feeling very festive actually. Saturday cook up. I've got some apple stewing in here. I'm going to add some cinnamon and bits and bobs. And then I'm making a chicken bone broth soup with that'll have like shredded pieces of chicken in as well. So in the soup, I put some onions, garlic, celery, beetroot, Swiss chard, coriander, rosemary, sage, uh, smoked paprika. More veg, there's more vegetable uh, mushrooms, so many veg, and all of the seasonings. Never seems to go wrong, just put everything in, and then some chicken bone broth, which I've got going in my slow cooker just here. And it's going to be the absolute perfect antidote to two late nights out in a row and some questionable food choices over the last few days. Soupy, soupy, got some nice sourdough from Dale's Food and my chicken broth which is in here take a look yum vegans look away <laughs> what 
also how's the outfit i mean <laughs> so last night I was doing really well fashion wise and now I'm just like no right let's check this crumble looks good nearly done so the crumble is buckwheat flour oats butter because butter is life for me um, and a little bit of stevia this particular stevia or stevia usually stevia has a horrible aftertaste but this one which is called sweet leaf is supposed to be the absolute best and i don't know why i bought a massive packet of it so i'm just kind of getting through it i like the idea that it's not like refined sugar and it's stevia what it does is it just like makes your taste buds register sweetness it's not actually sugar and i'm really against sweeteners like artificial sweeteners hands down but because stevia is like natural i don't know it'll taste nice chickeny brothy soup with loads of veg and some lentils brown rice and some fresh sourdough what do you think, Laura? Mm. Louder. Hot? Mm.